Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. Sa video na to pag-uusapan natin ng matrix addition at isama na rin natin ng matrix subtraction. Without further ado, let's get this lesson started. Matrix addition ay nangyayari lang kung yung dalawang matrix na i-add mo ay pareho ng size. Ibig sabihin, kung 3 by 1 yung isa, dapat yung kabila 3 by 1 din. At para makuha yung sum nila, written as A plus B, i-add mo lang yung mga corresponding elements ng matrix A at matrix B. Ito yung reason kung bakit same size sila dapat. Kasi dapat may corresponding element yung bawat isa. Otherwise, if they don't have the same size, then we can say that their sum is not defined. Kapag naman matrix subtraction, para lang din yung addition, kaso ang ina-add natin sa A ay yung negative ng B. In other words, kukuhanin muna natin Yung negative ng B, imumultiply natin yung B sa scalar na negative 1, tapos tsaka natin ia-add sa A. To better understand, let's have the following examples. Refer to matrix A and B, and we have to determine A plus B. Obviously, matrix A has two rows and three columns. That's why we have two by three matrix. Yan yung size ng A. Tapos, itong B, meron ding 2 rows at tatlong column. Kaya ito 2 by 3. Dapat laging chinacheck yung ganyan kasi baka mamaya add kayo ng add, hindi naman pala compatible yung dalawang matrix. So, i-add lang natin yung mga corresponding elements niya. We have 1 plus 4. This is negative 2 plus 6. 3 plus 8. 0 plus 1, 4 plus negative 3, and 5 plus negative 7. So to get its sum, kuhanin lang natin yung sum ng bawat elements. We have here 5, this is positive 4, and this is 11. Ito ay 1, ito ay 1 din, tapos ito negative 2. And then we're done. We move to the next example. Dito, imumultiply muna natin yung A sa 3, tapos yung B sa negative 2. Kung baga, ire -re write natin siya as 3A plus negative 2B. Ito yung sinasabi ko kanina na kung difference yung involved, kailangan yung second matrix ay imumultiply natin sa negative na scalar. Dito, I-diretsyo ko na yung mga product. So, this will be for matrix A, this will be 3. Again, 3 times 1 will result to 3. 3 times negative 2 will be negative 6. 3 times 3 will be 9. 3 times 0 is 0. 3 times 4 is 12. And 3 times 5 is 15. I-add natin sa negative 2 times B. So, this will be negative 8. And then, negative 2 times 6 will be negative 12. Negative 2 times 8 is negative 16. Negative 2 times 1, negative 2. This will be positive 6. And this will be positive 14. Tapos, tsaka natin sila i-add. 3 plus negative 8, that will result to negative 5. Negative 6 plus negative 12 will result to negative 18. 9 plus negative 16, that's negative 7. 0 plus negative 2 is negative 2. 12 plus 6, that's 18. And 15 plus 14, that is 29. So, yan na yung ating sagot. Itong 3A minus 2B ay pwede rin nating sabihin na linear combination ng A at B. Pinawag siya na linear combination kasi pareho nating minultiply yung A at B sa scalar tapos inad natin sila. So that's it for matrix addition and subtraction. Tandaan ha, yung matrix subtraction na galing lang yon sa matrix addition na may kahalong negative ng matrix. Thank you for watching. If you learned from this video, please give it a huge thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and hit that bell icon. See you on our next video.